The phones we carry around are pretty smart, but they could be a lot smarter. For example, they can connect to a server in another part of the world, but they have no idea that you're in a kitchen, in a conference room, or shopping at your favorite retail store. They lack micro-location context, but now that's changed with Estimo Beacons. They use new Bluetooth smart technology, supported by all major mobile platforms, including the recently announced iOS 7 with iBeacons. Put anywhere in the physical world, they broadcast context and location to all compatible phones and smart devices in range. Phones can now automatically pick up the signal and trigger contextual actions designed by business owners. Customers can enjoy a seamless experience with more information about the products that interest them. Photos, videos, reviews, personalized pricing, and even social updates. As they browse through the store, their phones will transition from one item to the next based on their proximity to the displays, enhancing the shopping experience every step of the way. Also, business owners can now benefit from quantitative location data on visits and customer feedback. Better for business and a better experience for shoppers. Let me show, let me show you some, let me show you some, some example. Yeah. So I have the beacons here. Um, so you can see if I approach the beacon, the black dot represents myself and my phone. So if I, if I move away the phone, it's, it's coming back. And if I approach it again, it's approaching the, the phone. So you can very precisely download location, the mm, estimate location, and you can see that there are different ranges. So depending yep. on the range, you can trigger different actions. So let me give you an example. You just approach a shoes, so you can see shoes. But if you, uh, w if you, if you walk away, let's say a few, a few meters away, it will change to something else, like a collection of shoes or a discount. Um, so this is basically without QR codes, without scanning, it just happens on your screen whenever you walk in and take out a phone out of your pocket. We're now in Paris, France. This is the Louvre Museum in Paris, France. And we put beacons on the entrance. So when a user approaches one of these uh, beacons, with the phone and our app's there. Core Location detects that, tells our app, and we can throw up an alert and say, hey, welcome to the museum. Your guide is ready to meet you. User swipes in, and we show uh, pertinent information and tell them where the guide is. Now, it's similar to the other thing we talked about, right, the other region monitoring, but the accuracy is the difference. You can do this right at the door. Maybe if you have many entrances to the uh, museum or whatever big location you have, each one can have its own eye beacon and it's a much tighter uh, accuracy, and you can know which entrance the user is for the guide to meet them. And we've heard of this painting, right? And we want to go look at it. And we're there with our museum app, exploring the museum, and we, we're constantly querying core location ranging to see if we're near an artwork. And we put some beacons at the artwork. We put a Mona Lisa beacon right on near the painting. It's hidden, you can't see it, but it's emitting Bluetooth LE. And as you approach with your app, Core Location tells us, and we'll pop a special UI to do with the Mona Lisa. We'll tell information about the Mona Lisa and the artist and whatever makes sense for your use case. We can expose some features like, hey, do you want to buy, I don't know, a print or a Mona Lisa calendar, ship it to your house, anything like that. Uh, so pretty powerful stuff right at the Mona Lisa. And then if you walk away, if you walk away, we'll dismiss that UI. And you, maybe you walk to the winged victory statue also at the Louvre Museum. And when you're nearby there, you detect that beacon, and you show them a different UI to do with the winged victory. And you show the information there. 